since we started a little bit later than normal, we will start a little bit earlier than normal by only five minutes. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, happy time zone, everybody. This is the Road to Dusk. You can call me Road Dusk, anything that you ever called a friend. I am a dream usher, so I focus on sleep, dreams, and the imagination to help create an environment where people can learn to be the better versions of themselves. And we have a very, very special night for tonight, and apparently we're starting off with me in the cute box because I forgot to turn it off. But, <laughs> happy Halloween, and if you celebrate Samhain, especially traditionally at sundown, or how are y'all doing? We are going to be getting into some scares for tonight. Speaking of scares, this is your reminder that we have, just for tonight, a very special sound redeem where you can scare me. Use it wisely. Because, as the title suggests, we are playing the Mortuary Assistant. And oh boy, this is going to be fun. <laughs> I'm also scared out of my fucking wits. Because I get intimidated just from seeing uh, Magnus play this when Faye plays it. But hopefully everyone's having a good time. If you were recently out for any Halloween party or anything like that, welcome back. If you are just chilling and it's don't... It's a chill game XD. <laughs> Depends on your level of chill. Also, I will say um, you may expect um some quality issues on the live stream it's because it's snowing in my area do not worry i am actively recording the vod and as i have been for the past while so the integrity of the quality will not be compromised when it goes on a youtube channel so yay that that said where are all my bots like, where's sound alerts? Where's stream elements? What in the world? Some of them are slacking! Let me actually double check that I am logged into sound alerts and that that's working as it should. Alright, should be logged back in. Okay. That should be good. As for the others, we'll deal. But yeah. Let me also... Let me also get ready to migrate us over to the game. But before we do that, I since we are going into scary game territory... We do have trigger warnings that will be here, that I will also be putting in chat, and I will also be explaining here. So, for we have corpses, embalming, cracking bones, like the sound of cracking bones, mentions of mental health and drug use, mentions of demons and demon possession, mentions of self-harm and depictions of self-harm, and harming others. Let me actually put that in the chat if I could potentially not click on other shit here we go and let me pin that for the rest of the stream but yeah I really hope that everyone has been doing well if there's anything that you're looking forward to for today or potentially for the rest of the year feel free to talk about it as we are going to migrate to our game <laughs> which what's interesting is that for whatever reason it's moved over to my other monitor settings quality medium I don't need super high quality with this thank you let's take you out of full screen let's migrate you here yay yes we need subtitles actually we'll keep the quality low just because I don't want to, I don't want to risk it. <laughs> uh, turn off the bloom. Volumetric fog. Eh. 
Okay, move is WASD, crouch is control. I heard the sensitivity is a little iffy. Okay, crouch is WASD, no, move is WASD, crouch is control, sprint is shift, quick inventory is RMB. The hell is RMB? Right right motion button because I see LMB here I don't know what RMB is supposed to be but okay you use the gurney is E right mouse button derp thank you elk <laughs> okay letting the letting strip is Q, the clipboard is space, inventory is tab, pause is escape. It's in game inspecting. Take is E, interact is left mouse button, right mouse button, leave the inspection. Why is the quick inventory and the leave inspection both the right mouse button? All right, well, I'm not planning to use my controller. So we're gonna be stuck with this. Also, let me turn off the cute box. There we go. Okay, so. Let's go. As I also turn off the audio here. Here we go. We should be getting the opening cutscene with like Rebecca talking to somebody in like a diner. Here we are. Oh, y'all should hear the game. You'll never understand why you chose such a macabre field. There's nothing but... disturbing about it. It's just but that I... I'm proud of you. I really am. What's next? Will you get a job in R or? They actually have everyone they need, but my old teacher, Mr. Delver, transferred me to his office to finalize my internship there. Oh, well, that's good. I remember you mentioning him. Where's he located? Are you moving away from me? <laughs> no, no, I'm not moving. He's actually located around here. River Fields. Oh, Rebecca. I don't like that. Grandma, even I've heard things about that place. Just be worried people about you. People make up stories. Death is a scary thing to a lot of people. I mean, we try to explain things we don't understand, and we want comfort when we lose someone we love. I mean, no one's embalming any ghost bodies or whatever. It's fine. Right, right. I'm sorry. But you... All righty, Heidi. I, I don't know if I want that. Just take it, please. It should be yours anyway. Yeah, a, a dog tag with a crucifix. Or at least a basic sort of talisman. All right. Also, Enough spooky stuff. I'm so proud of you. I just realized the game's a little loud for saw. me, so I'm going to turn it down. For a few weeks now. Gonna turn it up a little bit. Streaming so have to set you to like one percent, but lurking. Yay! Thank you, Tree. Hope you and Star are doing well. Also, yay! Internet's so much more stable now. <laughs> also, for those curious, I have some carbonated water to drink. And there wasn't... Okay. One last thing I forgot to give you. Please grab a pencil from my desk and sign. Thanks, Zoe. P.S. Good luck.
Okay, inventory. Yep, okay. Can I get any closer? Potentially a sign. Oh, I have to sign this thing. Oh, that music. Something already likes us. Namely because there's a body here that shouldn't be. And God damn, that's a bulge. I know rigor mortis is a thing, but I didn't think that... <laughs> oh boy. Rebecca. <laughs> Great. Perfect timing. I just finished with Mr. Dalton here. Please wheel him back to cold storage and bring us Mrs. Page. Oh, you dickwad. Damn, okay. To bring a body in or out of cold storage, open the bay with the body's name, pull out the rack, and move the cart over it. Okay. Oh, fuck. There we go. Yeah, left mouse button. Yeah, I'm... Yeah, okay. Oh. I was supposed to have pulled this. I I got you there. There we go. Hello. You I need to push in. There we go. Really hope everyone's doing well, by the way. Oh boy. This is one of two single-player horror games that has made me scream. Oh, I bet. Kenny! It's been a while, dude. Oh, I know this is going to make me scream, and I am dreading it. But, speaking of screams, if y'all really want to make me scream, I have a, a bit redeem that y'all can redeem. And it's only available for tonight. And the other I helped Selini get right. about halfway Just through, maybe 40% of the way the boat through. Boat and start recording identifying marks. I'll get out of your way when you're done and let you hop in here. Okay. Hover the cursor over unique markings such as moles, scratches, bruises, and interact with them to record them on the clipboard. Oh, interesting. That's an interesting feature. They have... Oh. You, you say to, like, go for the moles. There's one right there, but... <laughs> okay. 
Oof. Mm. These old windows never stay latched. How much do you know about this game? I I know a decent bit about the game. I've already been spoilered on it. Like I see Markiplier play it, I see Magnus play it. So I already know a good bit about it. It's just completely different when you watch other people play and when you play it yourself. Really? Just li little convenient how as soon as I turn, l l look at that. Almost looks like a leech that comes out of her front, at the front part of her wrist. Oh. Climb on in here and put everything into the record system. Don't forget to take the printout to the front desk so Zoe can add it to the packet for the family. After that, we'll get started. Okay. Okay, click on the record system icon to open the program, match the sections of your clip. <laughs> what was that? I didn't say anything. You all right? Y yeah, I'm fine. Mother of fuck, it's already here. Fuck me sideways. Match the sections of your clipboard through corresponding sections of a computer. <laughs> Once all the findings have been entered into the system, click submit. Okay. Record system name, Dorothy Page, age, 87 head, nothing. Shoulder, left shoulder, mole, right shoulder, mole. Leg, left leg, nothing. Left arm, contusion, right leg, nothing. Right arm, keratolysis. What does keratolysis mean? Oh, derp. I'm supposed to grab that and then follow. Where's the printer? Where's our printer? I feel like an absolute dumbass. Where's our printer? There it is. Embalming report. Got it. To embalm. All right, okay, so I did it right. Yay. Okay. All right. I've set everything out so you can just go ahead and get started. I'll be monitoring. Oh. Everything's on your list there if you need it. What do we start with? Do we go left to the right? Moisturizing pad. Wipe using the moist wipe used to moisturize the skin. Okay. Ah, uh, okay. Large items are held in your hands. If both hands are full, you'll need to drop a large item before picking up another. Smaller items are kept in your pocket. Selecting an item will view it. After selecting an item, its description will appear below it. If an item can be dropped, a drop button will appear under the item description. Neat. Bars the length of wire used with a needle injector, injector to wire a jaw shut. Oh great, scalpel. I'll do all of this for now. All right, where do I s fuck with you? Setting the face. Okay, pull the manipulator up and press the injector button. 
to drive barbs into the skull, then twist the wires to shut the jaw. Oh, that sound is blech. Big old blech. Okay, what do I do next? Placing the eye caps. Using the manipulator to open the eyelid completely, interact with the eye to place the cap. Okay. All right. Okay. What else do I need you? Can't hold anything else. Okay. You're only able to carry two large items at a time. Drop an item by opening your inventory. Okay. Oh. Wait, the moisturizer. I can't hold anything else. Okay. But the the moisturizer. <laughs> Do I need the moisturizer? Hold on. Go. Drop. Moisturizer. Can't use that here. If you see H3 uh, at your clipboard, it will tell you the order to use things in. Ah, uh, I see. Okay, mix the embalming fluid in the pump. I need. Okay. Glutarid. Uh, glutarate, uh, glutaraldehyde, methanol, humic, uh, humic tint, and formaldehyde. Okay. Do I already have all the things? Well, first let me. Get this out of my inventory. Give me the PVC. I need all the ingredients first. Fuck. Uh. Oh wait, he had grabbed everything. Okay. So, oh, derp. All right, let me get the PVC out of my inventory just because I know it's going to take space. Okay. Yeah, formaldehyde. Okay. Glutaraldehyde. Hold anything else. What the fuck? Why are y'all, why are each of you large? Why are each of you else? large? Oh, but I can't hold it in my pocket. Fuck off. <laughs> hmm. Sometimes we get chemicals that haven't been stored properly, and it can make them pop like that. Just keep doing your thing. Is that not a... S <laughs> Is that not a safety thing? <laughs> like, goddamn. Oh, it just goes out of my inventory when I'm done with it. Hello? You know, a bottle like that makes me think of flipping hydrogen peroxide. That. Okay. Okie dokie. Oh, wait, I need to cut you open, don't I? Fuck. Need to go to your fa- uh, to your- Yeah. I can't use- I can't use that. Oh, come on! Okay. 
clipboard. Yeah, make an incision in the cardioid and the carotid, the carotid artery and jugular vein with the scalpel. I was trying to do that. Let me get to your face. Oh, it wants me to cut on this side. Well, fine then. Some items need to be used directly on the body. To use an item, open quick inventory. I'm missing something. What am I missing? Oh, I need the moisturizing. Use the Forceps. forceps to clamp the tubing to both veins. Okay, where be the forceps? Are these the forceps? Yes, they are the forceps. I feel I'm probably only, give, only going to do like one shift of this for tonight, just cause, oh boy. I get scared very easily. I am incredibly jumpy tonight. All right, loud noise in three, two, one. Ooh, that's gnarly. It's thinning out. Well, it's still looking a little red, but it says that it got everything, so okay. Just stitch that back. Good as new. Okay, fill an empty IV with cavity fluid, then insert the troker into the abdominal cavity. Oh. Oh boy. I'm missing something. Insert the troker until it stops. What am I missing? I need... Oh, I saw that. I saw that, you bitch. Okay. I need to read my thing again. Oh. Right here. Quick inventory. I need my, my bag to be filled. Okay. And just automatically. Oh, that sound. Like a Capri Sun. Like a Capri Sun. <laughs> no. Absolutely the fuck not. All right, why are you having me go here? Hold on, let me check my clipboard. It won't let me check my clipboard. There we go. Okay, mix the cleaners in the bathroom closet to create tank cleaner, then pour into the embalming pump, then apply moisturizer at the end. Okay. Excuse me, cleaner base. Ah, uh, that's how I do it. Is 
Can't hold anything else. Oh, fuck you. Mother of fuck. So I gotta do this. Drop it. Back out. Gib. Go in here. Drop. Back out. Give me that. Come on, let me see that pretty face. What the hell am I doing wrong? Yeah, apply moisturizer to the facial features. What, were you not gonna, you weren't going to let me until the tank was done. You bitch. Move the wipe across the facial features while holding down to interact until the lotion is used up. No 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 What? Why don't you go ahead and head out? I'll take over from here. Uh are you sure? I just got here. Don't worry. You're doing great. I'll get the last of your paperwork sorted today and call you in for your first shift. Okay, Mr. Boss Man. Uh Oh. Go ahead. It's fine. I'll give you a call when we get someone in. Huh. Oh boy. Oh boy. Tutorial complete. Yay! That's not a big deal. No, I know. It, it wasn't even my fault, but he sent me home right after that. I was really worried. I was supposed to finalize my stuff today. And he said he would. So, that's a good thing. Yeah, it just didn't feel like he meant it. Like, he just said it to get me out of the building. Wait a oh. sec, I have another call. Hello? Hey, Rebecca. It's Raymond. Oh, hi, Mr. Delver. Uh, look, if I did anything wrong today, just... No, no. Um, I wanted to apologize. You've done a fantastic job. Just got here. Yay! That's uh, actually why I'm calling. I know it's late, but we just got three new cadavers. No one else can make it in right now. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, are you sure? I, I mean, of course. <laughs> Excellent. You're doing me a huge favor. I took care of the rest of the around morning. We're all set. Get your new badges and your personal belongings from the design room. That's great. Uh, thank you. I I'm on my way right now. I hope you feel better. Thanks again. And, uh, see you tomorrow. Bye. <laughs> oh, boy. Holy shit. That was him. He signed me on. He needs me to come in tonight. See? I told you it was fine. Congratulations. Thanks. I have to go. Like, right now. I'll talk to you later. Uh, where are my keys? <laughs> that, that's a mood. Okay. Now, where are my keys? <laughs> All right. Has to move around. Actually, let me do a thing real quick. Just checking on stuffs. Let's get that going. Okay. Now let's judge Re Rebecca with her life choices. So we have instant coffee, which I can't judge on. Um, we have a CRT. How in the fuck did you find a, a CRT, hun? Then again, this is 98. 
This is a cute, this is a cute little radio. Man, plastic <laughs> flipping drawers like this. Oh, that's a fucking mood. Music band shirt. <laughs> book is this? Death and Decay, a book covering the process and science of decomposition. Oh, that's her phone. She's a bit of a bookworm. Okay, a lot of a book, a lot of a bookworm. All right, girly. Let's see, you got your toothpaste up here with your cereal. Why wouldn't you just have it in your bathroom? Got a shoe rack. Got very rudimentary stuff in here. Got a bunch of takeout. Where are my keys? Derp. I forgot about her keys. There's her keys. Temporary items do not take up space in your normal inventory. Use temporary items by directly interacting with the body that with, with the object that requires it. Not the body that requires it. Okay, okay. Oh boy. We're getting into the thick of it. I am, I, I, I am scared. I is very much scared. But we will be rolling with the punches. All right. You got this XD. <laughs> really hope that everyone's been having a good uh, Halloween or Salon, by the way. <laughs> Oh, and they still got the Halloween decorations. Yes! Oh, oh there's little jack-o'-lanterns! Oh. oh, and the LEDs. during the evening and fucking and <laughs> fucking been forthright I'll just leave I'll just fucking leave you can't leave Rebecca I, I can't allow that you or your brothers it's far too dangerous also anyone got any good Halloween candy I has two bags one with um nerds gummy clusters and the other being Rolos which are little mounds of chocolate with caramel on the inside. One of the few times that I that I will ever eat caramel. I'll call again when we get to the apartment. No, wait. Oh, it. What the fuck? This is insane. Also, I might bump up the graphics just a little bit. Bring them up to medium. Okay. Resume. Like hello. Resume. Resume. Okay. There we go. Oh, that just helped out a good bit. Oh, and there's LEDs here. Play along and do your job. Okay, tape recorder, old key, hall key, and tape recorder. Yay. I had a granola. Does that count? I mean. If it does to you. That's not it. That's not it. Really? What's the old key? Fucking 
quit it tomorrow. We have got something like this. That's not it. Uh. Oh boy. All right, listen carefully. <laughs> Look, I'm sorry, but this entire thing is extremely unprofessional. Well, if this is how you treat new hires, I don't think I can work for you. This is impossible. Oh, well, let me grab the tape. <laughs> Yep, yep. To do that, you'll need to learn the demon's name. Bind it to its chosen body and burn it in the ritual. <sighs> Look, I know this is a lot to take in, but I wish I could do more for you. I had years to learn the demon code. You have hours. <sighs> I've recorded a number of cassettes to instruct you in the hope that having a physical object with a known message Okay. The tapes. Learn the demon's name. And burn the correct body. The most important thing in the room is in that cabinet. Open it up. Good luck, Rebecca. I'm sorry this had to happen. Yeah. It's insane. Whatever. Just... I, I know that that's supposed to be a skull, but at first, because of how little is shown, I thought that was like a fan of the opera mask. It was like, what, are we... Getting some music, the music of the night. A computer program combining all my findings into one reference point. Okay. The database contains all, all the information on the process of expulsion, the tools used, and most importantly, all the markings of the known demonic names. If you ever forget what to do, replay these tapes or look it up in the database. A collection of demonic names is the most crucial piece of the puzzle. You will. Be oh. I just have it on me. My ID card is in my personal belongings drawer. On the back is the passbook to access it. Use it. Okay. Well, I need the gurney. So I'm going to have the tape recording go while I'm grabbing. Okay, the process of possession. No. The more the demon will make itself known, allowing you the information to guess its name and the body it's bound to. The only way I've been able to tell how far along a possession is on your own is to scribble on a piece of paper. Don't think about it. Just scribble. If you notice anything strange, it's starting to take hold. There's a notepad and a pencil on the desk. Oh, well that worked. Oh boy. Well, I think I already found the body. That is a shit eating grain if I've ever seen one. Of expulsion. It must be bound to its chosen body and burned. The three objects in this cabinet your tools. First, the clay tablet in the center is called the mark. Okay. Okay. When the mark is placed on the correct body, it reagent inside. It will force the demon to become bound to it. Okay. Pay attention to signs that you have chosen correctly. They can be obvious or extremely subtle. Once you are certain the demon is bound to its vessel, burn it. Finally, the pieces of paper on the right are called letting strips. It must inscribe the sigils with its name. strip up while wandering the mortuary. It begins to smolder and burn 
Where is the legend weapon stick? They could be anywhere. So look up walls, under objects, inside furniture. Anywhere. The demon will inscribe its symbols over time to try and hide them. So check regularly. Once you uncover the sigils, use the night shift database to decide which demon you're dealing with. And use that knowledge to create the mark. Nothing yet. Okay. okay. Extra keys. Okay. Two, four, three, eight. Okay. Raymond, I really need the keys to the hatch outside. Cleaner is low, and you mentioned having some down there before. I know you don't trust anyone to go down there, but having a copy of the of the key. Would it make things a lot easier for everyone? Zoe. And we weren't, we haven't seen Zoe like at all. Uh, fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Uh, clipboard. Right. Oh. I need to inspect you. I'm saving your face last. Nope, 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 nope. Nope. Nope, nope. New job. I'm getting out of here. Excuse me, and you closed the door on me, you dick. How long will this go on? You go there. Fuck this. Oh, why am I going so slow? Nope. Nope, 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 whoops. It's it's fine. What? No, I just, you're just, I just need to talk. I'm just seeing things. I just need to get back to work. It's fine. Nope, 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 nope. I know I technically can't leave, but goddamn. Let's go. Oh, you're kidding me. I can't believe him. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, a good indicator that uh, the demons are onto something is, uh, or at least onto you, is when you see that uh, kaleidoscopic multicolored depth of field. Choice. I'm stuck here. Huh? Raymond, I know you said not to decorate for Halloween, but you need a little fun in your life. I did it anyway, and you're just going to have to deal with it, Zoe. And who might this be? No likey. No likey, no likey, no likey. Now I gotta get close to your face. Mm -mm. Nosferatu looking fuck. Oh, wait. Okay. 
I forgot there's like little Halloween style kind of skins now. So he's just meant to look kind of like flipping Nosferatu. Oh, fuck me. From this angle, it looks like he has a shit eating grin, though. Okay. Okay. Head. Oh, wait, age. Samuel Vaughn. Okay, shoulder. Right shoulder. Right arm. Left arm. Right leg. Left leg. Yay! Okay. You need to file a conflict of interest. Derp. Okay. Hope everyone's doing well, by the way. Y'all having fun with some scares? Uh, it's time to play ball. Where are my materials? Cause we are living in a material world and I... That's for not a hide. Nope, I do not need you. Yet, I will. No, oh, drop. Nothing. Oh. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. So I need to draw this for myself. Thankfully, I have some paper on the side. Okay. So. Okay. Neat. No. Oh, I drew that wrong. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. That's not going to be helpful. Okay. Okie dokie. Hooray! First sigil of the night. Okay. Ah, that's humicant. Can't use that here. Drop. Okay. I need to consult my clipboard. Okay, wire jaw with a needle injector. Okay. Where is the needle injector? That's the syringe. Here we go. Needle injector. Oh, that's a troker. Whoops. There's the needle injector. Oh boy. Ah, I see. You are just Nosferatu looking. <laughs> Dude must have had 
They didn't really give him an... Is that meant to be an overbite? Okay. Okay, insert the eye caps. Got it. I'm missing something. Oh, hmm? Where are my eye caps? Where's the eye caps? Hello? No. Oh, another note. Rebecca, Raymond asked me to take over restocking the rest of the supplies in the new bombing room, but he's so secretive, I feel like I get different instructions every day. Sorry if it's not what you're used to. P.S. Could you ask him to stop calling me Zoe? I'm like calling me Zoe. No one calls me that. Oh. Mm. I can just ignore that. I know that. The reagent in, in the old cabinet. Okay. Insert the eye caps. Where the fuck are the eye caps? There are draws under where you found the needle injector. Thank you. Ah, that's the scalpel. Those are the. Aha! Thank you. I'm gonna just ignore you. All right. Also, why only over the irises? Okay. Now, oh great, we get the embalming fluid. Okay, so. Go try to hide. I already had two of them here, so I'm gonna grab you. Ha <laughs> ha, fuck off. Oh no! No 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 no! Why? Why? Oh! Oh great! Oh! Oh! I just realized uh, this. <laughs> My PNG has been struggling a little bit to work, so I might need to actually bring this back down to low graphics. There we go. Oh yeah, that helped it a lot more. Oh boy! I have to go up to you! <laughs> no! Yeah! No, 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 no. Oh, great. It's a foreman. It's a foreman. Okay. Bleaching agent. No. No, 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 no. Already had that. The uh, humicant that I already had that. What am I missing? I need the glutaraldehyde and the methanol. Okay. Where is the glut? Glutraldehyde. And where is the methanol? I need that open actually. Oh! That's an IV. No, no. Anything else. Go 
try to hide. Methanol. There we go. Now I need the tubes. Yay. Oh, and I need you. Let me grab those. Thank you. That's not it. Don't forget the reagent in case you need to burn the body. I'm not 100% sure that this is the right one, just because I'm noticing this is pretty like Nosferatu-esque. And typically the ones that I have seen from other people's playthroughs that have been like, ho oh, oh, ho, it's me, have a shit-eating grin. Like this one has caused a decent bit of activity, and it had some blemishes, but it didn't have scratches and didn't have any marks. Oh. Well, reagent. I don't... Wait, do I need the reagent for all of these? Not always, but you can add reagent to multiple bodies. Am I required to do the reagent on all of them? Because it looks like that's it. It looks like that's what's barring me. I don't think you are required. Can't hold anything else. Oh, mother of fuck. What's in my inventory? The PVC pipes. Okay. I was about to say, was it fucking with me? Is it fucking with my eyesight? Maybe you are because this is your first proper body. Probably. Is there anything different with the blood? Oh boy. Turn off the pump, yeah, fill an empty IV with cavity fluid and insert the troker into the abdominal cavity. Got it. Keep forgetting. I already have one of those. I already oh, have one of those. Cool. Okay. I'm missing something. Where's my IV? Hold on. Fill an empty IV reservoir bag. Derp. Okay, so I need to find a reservoir bag. Where are my reservoir bags? That's the piping. That's the wipes. There we go. Hope everyone's doing well, by the way. I am trying to keep myself distracted and sane during this game. Did y'all have fun with anything for Halloween today? Or have you had fun regarding Halloween? 
or if Salen's more your thing. Have you done anything yeah. special for Salen? Slorp. Slip. All the slip. Okay, mix the cleaners in the bathroom for tank cleaner. Uh, excuse me. Hello. There we go. Okay, now. Now, okay, I need the moisturizer. Moisturize me, moisturize me! Pretty sure everyone has done that joke. Really, you're not gonna let me do it until you're done. Picky, son of a bitch. All right, was that everything? Yep, return the body to the cold storage. Okay. Yay. Probably time for another scare. Cause, oh boy. I, oh, no. Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Motherfucker just like clipped in and went yee. XD. Oh, mother of fuck. Okay. Are you gonna play nice? Oh boy. Well, you have a blister on your foot. A cigarette burn? Sir, are you okay? More abrasions. More abrasions there. Should rotate his hand. He's clean. A bro Boy got some acne. He looks young. His hair looks nice though. As weird as it is to say. <laughs> Right, I need to do everything in here. Okay. <gasps> Entry two, Derp. Troy Ross. He was young, 27, damn. Poor dude. Left leg, keratolysis. On the right leg, on the right leg. Human, uh, human, the hemangioma? What the hell is that? Oh, that was a mold. That looks like a fucking cigarette burn. Blemishes and a rash on the left shoulder. Oh, that didn't categorize his right shoulder? Okay, so 
that. Let's do a sanity check. Oh boy. I gotta be a little quick. Okay. Oh no. Oh, I need to grab another one. Derp. Let me, uh, hello? Now not taking any of my inputs. Well, <laughs> I know that the game was glitchy for Magnus, but damn. Okay, hold on, give me a moment. Uh oh. Yeah, I can't even move now. All right, exit the game. Skip. Continue. You've reached a checkpoint whenever you see this icon. Yay! Did I get my report? No, I have to put in his info all over again. Sir, you crashed my game. I need to save you for the right just because of how close. No, it would have been better to have that. Okay. Troy Ross, 27. Okay. I'll double check. Okay, so my inventory is completely clean. So. I need these. Can move that. Okay. And just for another check. Hoax road to have okay. him check Discord for a sec when he gets a chance. Oh, sorry, Bluey. Let me actually check that since I am paused. Okie dokie. Okay. 
Which, Bluey, hope you've been doing well. Like, I, I know you had the uh, subathon and everything regarding raising funds for helping out with, like, medical leave. So I hope things have been going okay. You've been feeling any better? I'm missing something. Wait, I thought it grabbed... Oh, I need to wire the jaw shut first. to do the eyes. All right. Okay. Now I have to do the, yes. Okay, the fluid. So grab you. Do I You're not penalized for Okay, so you actually have to do the reagent on all of them. Okay. As a precaution. Okay, cool. Oh, uh, what am I missing? For I was missing the scalpel. Here we go. I'm missing something. Huh? No, the forceps first, then the tubing. Okay. This game requires you requires you to get in a very particular rhythm. And I haven't seen any other sigils, to my knowledge. Oh. in a drawer somewhere. Somewhere in this cubicle. Oh. Aha! Okay. So... Okay. Got two. Is there a third? No. No. No! Oh, mother of fuck. Please, no. No, 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 no. Uh. 
Okay, still got time. What does it want me to do? Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Tree, thank you for a party of four. Scared the shit out of me. Hey, Tree XD. Three. Nice uh, timing. Okay, what do I need? What do I need? Huh. What do I need? Turn off the pump, remove the tubes, and close the incision. Okay. Oh, no, I need... Oh, I need the cleaner. I need the cleaner, but I don't know what it wants me to do here. This pleases me. Oh, thank you. Oh, boy. I will get a shout out for you when I can, or if I have any mods that are available, please. Please and thank you. Yeah, I already, have, yeah, one already have one of those. And excuse me. Yeah. Oh, I need the back of the cavity fluid first. Nope. I am picking up that phone. I am picking up that phone. Fuck you. Uh uh. Uh uh. Nope. 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 Also, let me get the shout out for you. For those that are hopping in from tree stream and don't know what we do around here, this is the road to dusk. You can call me road, dusk, anything that you would call a friend. I am a dream usher, so I focus on sleep, dreams, and the imagination to help create an environment where people can learn to be the better versions of themselves. I am currently playing the mortuary assistant for Halloween. Which, if you celebrate Halloween, either secularly or anything religious, happy Halloween. If you celebrate Samhain, or many of the names therein, uh, Blessed Samhain, or Ikehauna Um If you celebrate uh, Happy Day of the Dead for uh, tomorrow, then Feliz Dia de los, uh, Feliz Dia de los Muertos. Uh, what the fuck am I doing? <laughs> uh, right, okay. Uh, cavity bag, cavity bag. Brain is not working! Yeah, insert the troker. Right. This is stomach. This is abdominal. I'm missing something. Wait, what am I missing? Oh, mother of fuck. There we go. But we do a lot of stuff around here. <gasps> no! Forbidden Capri Sun. No, 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 what are you doing here? Huh? I mean... Was it, is it 1944? Because Raymond was born in 44? Oh, he's getting there. Fucker's getting there. Okay. Okay, so it's somewhere in here. The fuck are those? Fuse, an old screw and fuse.
Where are you at? Where are you at, fucker? On the other side of the door? No. The other side of this door? No. Ah, there you are. Okay. Don't know if I'm looking at you in the right direction. I'll do swirly there, swirly there, and a circle. That is the weirdest symbol I've seen. Okay. Right, because it caught me off guard in the middle of the procedure. Oh boy. Man, this is throwing me completely off with trying to do my whole shtick. Um, but do you know that um, we are an 18 plus uh, streaming platform and community. Um, we do have uh, content warnings and trigger warnings for the mortuary assistant up in chat and on screen. As a reminder, with what this game does, it... Uh, it obviously depicts corpses of the embalming process. Um, it also depicts, um, it mentions demons and demons possession, which it's trying to get a hold of me. No. Um, also talks about things related to like mental health some uh, scenes will also depict and mention drug use, um, so be wary of that. Um, there is also stuff in relation to like harm, self-harm, blood, viscera, cracking bones. So uh, please be mindful of that. If this, if you're not in a good headspace for this, you're more than open to step away. Feel free to prioritize yourself. We're primarily doing this for the scares. If you want to contribute to the scares, uh, there are plenty that there's some point redeems that you can do to help out with that because I am very jumpy tonight. Who to guess why? But if any of that is of interest to you, please feel free to stick around. I would very much appreciate hey. the company. Ads. No, not the ads. Ads are more terrifying than the game, lol. <laughs> Get in there. <gasps> no! Excuse me? All right, now you got me suspicious. It might be the Nosferatu body. Jiggle physics on the corpse. Okay, mole on that foot. For realism XD. Oh. Yeah, scratches on your arm. Great. Okay. 
Demetria. I have never heard someone named Demetria. I'm assuming that's a femme version of like Dimitri. Excuse me. H. H. I was working on it. Uh, what else are you wanting me to do? You turned off my light again. Asshole. Time to embalm. So first we need forceps again. Wire your jaw. We're doing eye caps. Grab you as well. Okay. Okay, and now All right. He did also that one body did also have the weirdest eyes. Clipboard. Yep, I need the embalming fluid. Okay. So not a hide. Yay, okay. Oh, it wants me to close the lid. Close the lid. That's not it. Oh, I need the reagent. Fuck. The reagent. There we go. Oh. Oh, it is reactive. It wants me. It wants me. lot of activity from you with this one. But I think I probably had more activity with the first one. Is there a force sigil anywhere? Right. Okay, reservoir back. Got it. I'm missing 
Uh, I need the sucky suck thing. Well, that was kind of useless for me to grab the forceps. Well, the scalpel. Oh boy. Okay. Yay! What did I need after that? A mix of cleaners for tank cleaner, the moisturizer, and then setting it back. Still need a four sigil. Oh wait, I have tank. I have the cleaner that I need up here. Let me just grab you. Cleaner base. And I have three of the sigils, so I could possibly do a process of elimination. But I'm going through this semi quick. Oh! Excuse me. Motherfucker just locked me out! Oh. Oh no. Oh yes. Oh dear fuck no. No! No, 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 no. So you get two of me by the bed, get the needle from the bathroom, find a lighter, get the spoon from the coffee table, find a full baggie on kitchen counter. Oh, great. We're going through her routine on getting fucking shot up. Get tubing by the bed. Needle from the bathroom. I can't grab anything. Is it because my inventory is full? No. He won't even let me grab the lighter. Exit. Continue shift. Come on, game. No. Hey, uh hun. Oh. Okay. Hey, Angel! Hope you're doing well. Oh, do I gotta embalm this body all over again? How far did it... How far did that set me back? All the way fucking back. Oh, you bitch. Okay. Hope you're having a good Halloween. Or if you celebrate it, happy sailing. Okay. I'm good. I played this some on stream today too. Nice. It got me to scream once. Ooh woo. Oh, this has already gotten me getting like nope, nope, nope. Speaking of screams, I do have a uh, a uh, 
excuse me. Uh, audio redeem thing for the like, using bits <laughs> if people want to use it. This is the only night that you can do it before I get rid of it. Because I normally don't do scares. Okay. Give me forceps. Give me scalpel. Give me eye caps. Give me tummy thing. The star has risen in the sky. Oh. I was loud and hostile. That helps me when scared. XD. <laughs> Hello, Road in chat. Hey, Star. I hope you were doing well. I saw you were streaming earlier. Oh, wait. I need to grab your paper. Oh, I made I grilled cheese it. sandwich. There we go. Made grilled cheese sandwich. Oh, grilled cheese sounds good. I had hankering good. 030. Hey, Star. Okay, Gib. Hi, Elk. <gasps> no! What did you do? <gasps> no! Oh! No. Why? It's okay, they are friendly. Oh, mother of fuck. If you're a Demolitor, maybe. Or Demonolitor. Oh, nope, 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 nope. I don't have a strip. I don't have a strip. I don't have a strip. Gib, 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 gib. Oh, it's getting there. Everybody, will we, will we possibly have a force sigil? Or is it wanting to be a dick? Shoot, forgot DX. <laughs> no. Yeah, just put that in the clips channel if you want star. <laughs> Which, for those who do not know, we do have an official Discord server in collaboration with Nebulas Noxies, who normally does a lot more horror than me. Um, oh, I grabbed your stuff, so I need to file it. I had a grilled sandwich my mind made up. Provolone and Colby Jack cheese grilled sandwich with tomatoes and baby spinach on a brioche bun. Hey, yo, that sounds fucking amazing. I squished a little bit and got myself Panda Express because I was too lazy. And also, I've been the only person in the house. There we go. Now I need to grab Oh no Fuck you bitch Oh Oh that just sent a shiver up my spine Fuck that. Beat them up, bro. God's damn noise. Fuck all of that. After the shift is done, I I I might switch to a different game. Like probably Cult of Lamb or something because Jesus. Okay, what am I missing? What am I missing? What am I missing? I'm missing that. Huh? Okay, now it's in my inventory. Now I need a reagent. Okay. 
Need the piping. How a lot of stuff has been going on. Not sure if it's gonna be the Nosferatu body or this one that I sent as a cremator. Because the Nosferatu one just one looks like Nosferatu. And that one had its um, door swing open. But this one has been a lot more active. So I'm not sure. For those that have been watching, actually, for, for those that have been in since the start, from all the bodies that I've been having to mess with, which do you think is the one? What am I missing? Okay, now I start with the IV bag. I grabbed one of these already, right? I already have one of those. Yes, I did. Uh huh. Why? Oh. No. Don't make me go in there. No. No, 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 no. Just guessing RN. Don't make me go in there. I have to go in there, don't I? Dude! <gasps> Give me your fucking dominion! Give me your fucking dominion, you asswipe! I'm out of food again, W. Oh no! Creepy made me play out last equals n equals tree. Okay. Ah. Uh. Star. I do not like this game, and this game does not like me. So we are on mutual terms here. Tackles tree and shoves a freshly made sandwich down his throat. How many times this game sustenance. has? Temporarily crashed on me. Star, do you like Capri Sun? Oh my word. If only DX. Right, I have to make. I mean, are you offering? Y'all ever get like so scared that you start feeling like pins and need? Oh. Oh, we're pulling this shit again, huh? Are you gonna let me actually get the shit this time? Giant. No. Morning. Oh, you son of a bitch. Bad things happen. Oh. Okay. Where? What are my controls to crouch? Crouch is control. Massive trigger for people. Okay. Oh. Why is it not? There we go. There's the tubing. 
use for restricting blood flow. Really? You're using the tubing as like a temporary also, tourniquet Mishka, or something? She was in panic slash pry tuck mode during Outlast. Oh no! W. You are much braver than I am to play this game. Needle from the bathroom. The community wanted it, especially since uh, this is what uh, one of the redeems from um, when I had my affiliate anniversary donathon in September. Is it snowing for you? Yes, it's been snowing for me. Find a lighter. Okay. Get the spoon from the coffee table. Find Started a full bag on the ago. kitchen counter. My thumb feels funky oh, still. Oh boy. Trigger warning for drugs. Nope, 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 nope. I also hate that the game forces you to go through this. I know. I wish that you couldn't, but at the same time, also, sometimes I made homemade barbecue meatballs today. Realistically, when you have trauma and whatnot, it it just happens. Yes, we have his dominion. Okay, that helps. Okay. Okay. So now we are officially now on a super big I time saw, crunch. I go run now. No. <laughs> you can turn off the story events so it's just the scary bits that don't really relate to the character. Yeah. Oh boy. And top hat is home. Okay. Come on. I meant like, we know about her past, but why do you make us gather the things for her to use, especially when she is clean? Ha ha! Okay. So. Now, I believe, oh, we just, okay, we made the tank cleaner. We have to clean the tank. Then, moisturizer. So we're on a time crunch now. Where's the... brain is now blinking on where the moisturizer is. There's the moisturizing wipes. There's some moisturizing wipes. You, ma'am, have been very active. All right. <gasps> I say that right when you pull. No. Oh, oh, you bitch. Oh, you bitch. Oh, you're going in the fucking cremator. You are going in the fucking cremator. How far do we have to go? Gonna play Overwatch to relax as weird as that sounds, but I'm a lurk. Well, thank you for the lurk. Also, for those that are hopping in and don't know, there is a new, uh, well, new-ish command, uh, oh, fuck you. For the Daily Obel, why? God has left you. Oh, fuck you, bitch. This is not the body. This is not the body? Y you think so, Star? Was it the first one? No. 
Nee. Nope to this one. This one has been incredibly fucking because active. Because this body is only doing cutscene haunts. Oh boy. Okay. What did the first body do? I forget. Was it active? I I I forget. <laughs> I, I remember that this there whole was. Game is just uh, nope. This whole game has just been nope. Uh, the first one looks like flipping Nosferatu. Did her body change at all? This one's body uh, kind of moved around like that. The first one, uh, his body didn't move around at all. There was a point to where when I was grabbing her, um, when I was grabbing the body that was next to his, that. Uh, the first body's door swung open. I think first body. You think first body? Then yes, it's first body. Okay. Two, four, three, eight. Okay. Got it, got it, got it, got it. If things happened with the first corpse, it's that one. This one okay. is a red herring. Ah, uh, okay. Oh. Huh? That's none of those. So I haven't gotten there yet. But let me go. Th okay, so see, I know it has one. Of, it has that that those two? Okay, so it's not invidious. It's not in the invidious domain. Let's try this one. Nope, none of those either. Also too, sometimes if you check the bodies after you have marked them, if the marks have changed in any way, that's also a way to check for the body lol. Ah, okay. Aha! Found it! Okay, so. I know way too much about this game for not having played it myself, lol. Okay. Back out. Okay, so... I am in ads. No can Damn. hear you, lol. All Asterisk good. W. Okay. Same star. I watch a lot of streamers play this XD. Well, glad y'all have fun watching other people just struggling. I'm gonna take your word. I mean, horror games don't spook me. Ask Elk. I wasn't spooked playing Outlast XD. <laughs> okay. <gasps> no! So this is the first body. I was, however, glad for convenient mm. censorship. 
Why are your lights flickering? You dick. So this I had no interest in seeing Booba Gump dick on my stream. Thank you. This is the first body. Double check what markings I had listed. Okay, Samuel Vaughn. Yeah, face with blemishes. Okay. Can't really inspect him again. But we really think it's the first one. Yup, mark him up and light him on fire. I I do not care if I get it right or wrong. I am going to do it. I can't use that here. What do you mean can't use it here? How do I? Are those symbols in the correct order? Yes. I know for a fact because I went through all the dominions, and with all the sigils that we have, but we don't know the dominion of him yet. Snag the sigil. I I did. Put it on his body. Because it's not giving me a concrete um, sigil here, but with all the si but with all of the smaller sigils that we found that correlate to his name, the only one that has all of the ha that has all of the sigils is Talnik. Uh, well, Go tell on the other side of his body and put it on his chest. Cause yeah, you have this like black, like swirling, three strand, um, Sharingan fucker. Uh, you have like an H with those. You have a symbol that looks like a capital F in Rame, and then you have this one that looks like a brooch. This is the only one that I've seen in all of the in all the houses that actually has all four of those sigils. Cuz like if we look no 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 yes no 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 yes no 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 yes yes. And then if we look in desolation, yes, no, 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 yes, yes, no, 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 yes, 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 no, no. Do remember you are on a timer. No! No, 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 no. You can get the right body and still get possessed if you don't do it quickly enough. Why? Let me grab the gurney. Go, let him go, let him go. Burn Nosferatu. Burn Nosferatu! I'm gonna stay in the corner here, cause oh, no. No, 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 no. Come on. So let him up, 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 let him up, 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 let him up, 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 Got him. I think there's. I'm pretty sure there's a very specific uh, cutscene if you didn't get it in time. 
this when you're able to burn a body there's very specific end shifts the end shift cutscenes Our, uh, all right, keeping an eye on the corners to see if there's no End. kaleidoscopic. No possession. Oh, we got the right body three. Oh, I don't want this. I just want to leave. What do I do? The fact that it took a little over two hours. Why is he so quiet? I, sorry, the game. I, I have. Barely hear him. Here, let me turn up the game. Something larger, but I don't do this for some greater good. We either face it or fall to it. There I wish we I go. Could claim to be someone better, Three. Suffering hell to save us all. But I simply want to live another day just like everyone else. When I first experienced this, I had to make a choice. I could run and spend the rest of my days in fear, or I could learn to face it and keep some semblance of a normal life. Normal. Right. It's not a life oh. I would want for anyone, but choosing between a life of fear or control you're the first person I've met to face this hell and survive. So I'm offering you a different kind of job. Work the night shift. Learn what I know. Give yourself a chance at a life beyond fear. I don't know what you experienced, but I know it uses the worst parts of you against yourself. The more you experience, the more you'll confront the darkest parts of your life. But through it, you'll become unbreakable. Rejoice. Yay! I'm offering the tools to take control. The choice is yours. While this is going... I'm... Did you get food? Three. <sighs> oh boy. So. I do want to Yo, figure out... You did it. I do want to figure out um, another thing that we can do because I found a frozen microwave Mediterranean lentil meal in the freezer that I forgot I got at some point. That game just screwed with me. So I'm tempted to play a different game. Yay. Uh, if y'all are okay with it. I was thinking like Call to the Lamb for shits and giggles, but if another there's a game. different game that you guys would want, I can do that. I actually do have access to Magnus's whole library. So if necessary, I could do Go stuff like it. World Play of Horror. Play something that'll not give you nightmares XD. <laughs> Let me exit out of the game for now. Oh, Everybody do, do the, the flop. flop. Thank you for the flop. I still haven't played World of Horror, but I have it. Oh. Also, let me move over here for a quick bit. Let me actually set up a poll for this. Three. New poll. What game? Oh, I'm on cap lock. What game should we play? Strip. King shoulder slut. Strip. <laughs> Your Game? subjects have commanded it. <laughs> well, if my subjects have commanded it, then damn. <laughs> you know what? I'll do you one better. I'll, I'll have I'll have some eyeballs there, because apparently the eyeballs need to see this this magnum opus as well. 
Ah, there we go. <laughs> All right, what other games could I do? Let's see, that one, Cult of the Lamb. And for a Smacks quick- Smacks the shoulder booty D. <laughs> oh my God. Y'all are dorks. I love y'all. Uh, do, 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 do. Trying to think what all could be done that relates to scares, but shoulder booty won't be super bad. Do, do, do. Huh. Oh goodness. Wouldn't that just be your hip? <laughs> All right. So for the rest of stream, which is going to be about an hour and a half, let's figure out what we're going to stream. For five minutes, y'all can go crazy with picking whatever, whatever game from the five that I have listed that you're most curious about seeing. We have a little bit of a kinder game super mario wonder which is brand fucking new cold not to the a lamb is your booty shoulder not your world shoulder of horror booty. escape simulator and alice madness returns Let's see. Oh, we have some requests for... Y'all, as a reminder, you can skew the votes with just one obol <laughs> to request what you want if you have that much of a passion for it. <laughs> oh my god! Y'all are going... <laughs> <laughs> it is a battle between Cult of the Lamb and World of Horror. At least with what I'm seeing right now. Holy shit. Hope y'all have been having fun with enjoying the scares, though. I wonder if anyone had like a favorite part from tonight. I know Star, you got some good clips there. Also, I think this is the first Halloween, to my knowledge, that I have had where it's snowing. Go stuff yourself, tree. <laughs> tree, go has food. If you has food, go has food. Also, for anyone that does or doesn't recognize this music, uh, this is the music that I made for the Nuke Tears. This is their little intro theme that I made Why for the them. Why is no one helping me? <laughs> Bastards. Traitors. I, I made this music for them, but I figured I do not have the spoons to like make any extra scary music so i'm just gonna be using what i made for them for <laughs> like scary music for the courts of streams <laughs> oh my word y'all are going off Hi, i've been here the whole time <laughs> drag <laughs> Did, did you mean to write hi as in <laughs> hi instead of like hi as in like hello? Three C maybe. <laughs> Hit dork. Oh boy. 
Time tree out for food, damn you. <laughs> After this, I have poor people food. I mean, food is still food. Food is still food, buddy. Also, good. holy cool. moly, like, <laughs> oh, we're at 69%. Yeah, nice. <laughs> We're at 69% for World of Horror. Y'all are just killing it. Y'all want it that bad, huh? Y'all y'all really want to go crazy over, like, Eldritch Horror Jinji Ito, don't you? But I, what I was going to say after this poll, I will make another poll that's only I mean, going to be one Junji minute. ITO. That's only one minute long of should I time out Tree to make him go get food? Also, by a fucking landslide. World of Horror with 972 votes. <laughs> Thank you for the bat. Guess, guess we're doing World of Horror. Star, you're just jealous of my fast fingers. Three. Let me get things set up. The game might be a little loud at first, considering I literally just downloaded it. So be patient. That thing spiked. You cheated. That sounded kinda sus. Tree. Ow! 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 I did not. Oh, that was Heck super. Is that noise? It was the game. It was the game. Which? No, he just. I want y'all to, to see that. Fingers. Three. I want y'all to see that. So, new poll, real quick. One minute. It was Road trying a new back massager that died. <laughs> ha! You gonna give me a demonstration? Three. All right, one minute on the clock. There we go. Gonna have that up. And let me switch over to here. Let me open up the game again so that you can see that interesting um, animation. Cause holy fuck. Okay. How did Tree cheat? <laughs> Wait, what? Tree is not... Where? Alright. What are my options? Oh, there's different colors. Two bit mode, one bit mode. I don't think it's possible to cheat lol. <laughs> Tree did not cheat. One to one that scale, two to XD. one scale, three to one scale. Disable extra effects for certain scenes for more FPS. OMG, look at the poll. <laughs> I know I was agreeing, haha. -ha. <laughs> Alright. So what the heck? Well, the max time that you can be. I will only time you out for like. I'm eating already, and that's why I didn't vote. Get <laughs> One person voted no. One person voted no. <laughs> Y'all. I wonder who. All right. Well, the community has spoken, Tree. I will only time you out for like 10 minutes. It wasn't me. Nui. Starmari16 contributes 96 points. <laughs> Don't be suspicious. Can't imagine why.
Th there we go. <laughs> All right. Let me know if visuals get uh, crummy. You guys should be able to see the game okay. All right. Bye, tree. Get wrecked, dog. <laughs> oh my Tree god. will return with full belly soon. Yay. Oh boy. Let me know if you need me to turn up the game a, li a little bit more. We oh. love you, Tree. New story. We do love you, Tree. The, the, this is all in good fun. If this was legit crossing a boundary or was triggering in any way, please let me know and I'll rescind the timeout. That this is all meant to be in good fun, but if is this if this is legit hurtful, I I I will rescind. Hold on. Okay. Would you like to customize your new playthrough's look? There are many color palettes to choose from. Two bit. Red. Ooh, I like that. Sepia. Mm. No, I don't like that invert. I like these more pastel. Uh... I can hear oh, you speaking breathing. Of pastel, I don't breathe that hard. I'm also a pretty decent bit away from my computer. I might go for that. Ooh. No, this will be good. Dear God. Poor tree. <laughs> the game is breathing. Alright, it's your first time playing. Let's see. It is recommended that you start with the spine chilling story of school scissors option for trying more complex playthroughs. Yeah, the 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 difficulty. One Cthulhu? Two Cthulhu, two Cthulhu, three Cthulhu, way too fucking many Cthulhu to be comprehended. <laughs> Wait, starting new encounters will kill you if you drop below one stamina or reason, but you can drop to negative five Cthulhu, in combat. Pulus, Pula threes, Salgo. <laughs> This option will allow you to rethink Prepares your strategy. Prepare a slice of a pumpkin spice cake roll and milk for tree. That is how I am measuring game difficulty from now on. Let me put it on difficulty one, make it a little easier for me, just cause I know that this game can be a bit unforgiving. All right. That's normal difficulty. Yeah, bring it down to easy difficulty. City of Shiokawa, Japan, 1980X. Something strange is happening in our town. Robbed figures can be seen gathering... Well, robed figures can be seen gathering in the woods at night. People are going missing. Disgusting creatures are terrorizing the, sea, uh, the seaside. The rapid technological progress of the modern era brings comfort, but also new unknown Ooh. threats. Old gods, malicious eldritch beings who ruled the earth eons ago, are awakening as reality starts to crumble. 
Armed with clues, spells, and your dwindling sanity, you'll investigate mysteries across the city what? and in realms beyond. Why An old no speak booba. <laughs> <Why not? laughs> An old train slows down and stops at the last station. The end of the world is at hand, and you've finally arrived at the doomed town. Oh boy. I found a Taiyaki? Oh, Taiyaki is fucking delicious. I should probably change my uh, info here to... Let's change it to... There we go. Okie dokie. The story so far. You've been following the weird cult for weeks now. Barely surviving the encounter with the skin hag of the nursery. It's a race against time, and you can't rest until our town is safe. Spine chilling story of school scissors. Another boy from your school has disappeared. Rumor has it, a terrible woman has returned from the grave. A woman with the widest smile and the sharpest scissors. Oh, fuck! That's just fucking Kujisake Onna! You knew your friend was up to something when he left you with his, when he left you his notebook full of cryptic notes. I can send her back where she belongs, he claimed. After he too disappeared, you decided to study the notebook for clues. It details a ritual that claims to stop the wicked woman once and for all. What's the worst that can happen? Which, let me actually... Let's switch up the trigger warnings. Which I have to fix up. I believe these are the core um, trigger warnings, which will also sound on uh, the text to speech. TW for World of Horror, Combat, Psychological slash Eldritch Horror, Mentions of Harm and Self Harm, Body Horror. Which those are the bare minimum uh, trigger warnings. And let me also change them on the screen. Here we go. Very, very rudimentary trigger warnings, but hopefully this is helpful for everybody. The school is eerily quiet at this hour. Your missing friend has left you a notebook. If the rumors are true, you to stop the tall woman with scissors, you need to perform a ritual to force her material form to appear in our dimension. Accomplishing this requires first the drawing of an eldritch sigil, and then the lighting of holy candles. You can only hope your friend has left them somewhere around the school. Road. What's up, Star? Dear Christ. What? I must show you this now. Oh boy. <laughs> Send it in DMs. Check DMS. What do we got? Oh my word! <laughs> also, do not forget 
Y'all can do some New stairs. To my eyes are up here. I was about to say. Y'all can still get some scares Scree. in. Scree! Oh, the ten minutes is up. <laughs> Tree. All right. Uh, explore the school. Bird riot. Oh boy! Tackles and loves on the tree. A tall woman with an upsetting face and twitching lips stops you. I'll be your new Jones biology feet. teacher. Could you help me move some stuff to my new office? Hello, you sweet bean. You, you know what? Nourishment now. Three. I I am too nice for my own good, so you know what? I will help her. Luck check success, baby! Yay! Three for the chomp. Three. The creepy substitute teacher hands you some old books to carry. Among the mundane titles, you find one called The Extinction of Mankind. You shudder, feeling the teacher's gaze on your back. Plus 5 XP! Yay! Resolve the event! Chomps for the spray 8B. Okay, I couldn't find chalk and I couldn't find holy candles. You feel like something horrible is happening within the school. You must hurry and find those items. Oh boy! Put some time out, cage. Bad verbs get time out. <laughs> you hear a faint sound while walking inside the we'll biology classroom. See. Inside is an old anatomy model. It's heart beating. I was already in time the out. The sight eight. almost makes you sick. Minus one stamina. Resolve this event. For ten minutes. Something evil stalks the empty school corridors. You found an additional page from your friend's diary. It seems that the blessed well chalk fed. was left in the pool. Equals you must w hurry and equals. find it. I was already eating. You enter the damp smelling sport wing. You notice a backpack drifting on the swimming board in the middle of the school. Could it be what you were looking so for? So you claim. You enter the pool and start swimming towards Pat's the backpack. Tree. Suddenly the water turns murky and you realize you're not alone in the pool. Oh boy! A bloated figure emerges from the murky water, blocking your only way out of the pool. Oh no! It's a fat bastard! <laughs> w, thank you, Elk. During each turn, you will build a sequence of attacks and moves from the from the action rain B. Okay. Once you have filled the sequence bar. Press the launch sequence button to finish your turn. Fill the combat sequence, the white bar, with combat moves and click the launch sequence to attack your enemy. To right click is to delete the last Golden combat. Flash. BRB. What happened to Mortuary Assistant? I finished up. So I finished up like the the main shift and I was like okay I'm done and people wanted Star me to do world of horror we're not playing cult of the lamb lol people okay with time you will discover people. new combat moves Good available sir. through aha you mean a tree. She's jealous of my dexterous fingers. Colon. Ellie gasp I haven't even had the time to start playing it yet TWT. I done in tree, you're going to have to show me what those fingers can do. Hey now star don't blame tree. I also spammed the vote for Wo. You were the traitor. That's why it jumped. Ha 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 ha. Okay. Colon slash. Why is it not letting me? Oh, 55. Okay, BRB. Okay. So what were you wanting, Star? Attack boost.
Oh, come on. Plant stuffs do not fill me enough. I might have a chicken patty left. Mother of fuck, I'm literally just... Ah! Road. DMS. Goodness gracious, what are you sending me, Star? Yeah. All right, game, come on. Also, real quick, I'm actually going to give a shout out to Nebulous Donkeys. Okay. So I need to figure out the exact way that it wants me to... Wines, I want to be there. I don't like being away from Hummy Re. I get you. Okay. Why not home? I just noticed. There we go. Well, that's 200 to 200. Why can't I launch the sequence? It's always weird sleeping and not hearing your snores XDX. Oh my <laughs> Hold on, but first you need a weapon. Oh, find and choose an action called look for an improvised weapon. I am confusion. Hold on. Okay. Yep, yeah, and he hit me. Okay. A new item has at appeared Star in Mario your inventory. I'm staying at my mom's for a few nights to hook up my brother's dialysis machine See, while she's in the UK. In the upper right corner, select the item with your cursor and open the item submenu. Oh well. Giving my aunt a break from having to hook Where him up. Where did the Hold on. In the UK, oh well. Wait. Where's the I weapon? I am glad it's a family effort, though. Three. At Starmari 16 Road is a notorious snorler. We sleep in the same room, XD. Let's dodge. Was it the eye? So that's the item with your cursor and open the item sub menu. You share a bed. I know XD. Open the item sub menu. What is the what the fuck is the eye supposed to do? Combat skill. Where? Okay, so it was the eye. Select the item with your cursor, the sub menu, and the sub menu being. At Starmari 16, well, last time it was just me and Grandma doing it. That wasn't possible this time because I'm living two plus hours uh, away. Ah! It was a straight razor. Okay. Okay, now how do I go back? I don't have ch time to change the equipment. And Lucky okay. keeps ignoring me, the big Mina TWT. Aww. 
Oh yeah, upper right corner. Oh, was it the branch? Ah. Uh, back. Welcome back. Wonder if he doesn't realize it's me cause my sense changed due to starting tea. It w. might be. It might be the case. Okay, he's getting ready to... How do I defend? Or he's just met I'm never around anymore. Oh, I'm getting scuffed. Okay. Minus two stamina damage. Oh, that's him. So. Sorry, did you say scuffed or stuffed? Scuffed. Okay. Sorry, I'm playing Fosmo at the same time XD. All good. Yay! Okay, you found the blessed chalk, which you can use to draw the sigil in your ritual. You copy the sigil as best as you can on the on the blackboard. Hopefully, it'll be enough. Oh, well, we still need the candles. Other pages seem irrelevant to the case. I hope they're okay. Okay. Maru is acting strange. She needs to talk to her after class. I hope she didn't attempt a ritual herself. The sigil can weaken the demon for a while. Careful with the lines. I put in the candles in one of the classrooms. Tomorrow I'll try to perform the ritual. Okay. Now we know where to look. Go back. Explore the school. We need to go into one of the classrooms. For the candles. As you enter the school gym, you notice a strange black doll uh, propped up against the wall. Oh, great. Minus two reason. No! Against your better judgment, you approach the doll. What you see makes you gasp in horror. The doll isn't a doll. Your sudden movement causes tiny black spiders to flee, revealing a white, half eaten corpse. Oh, boy. Sounds of scissors is getting louder. You have to hurry. Oh no! A tall woman. See, I helped her out before. Oh, poor elk. Uh, what's up with elk? Is elk okay? You found the holy candles in your friend's backpack. You lit them as instructed by the notebook. Everything is ready for the ritual. Perform the ritual. Wait, what is that? Oh. Oh boy. The sigil and holy candles doesn't seem to have any effect on the horrible monster. Have you, you drawn it wrong? Elf fears the eight-legged critters. Uh, frozen in fear, you watch as the twitching horror gets closer. It raises its enormous scissors and croaks. Am I beautiful? Twisting and twitching, the demon woman enters the classroom, cackling menacingly. Oh boy. Yeah, that's just... That's just a fucked up kuchisake onna. Alright, 30 HP. Minus 2 to all when it comes to damage. And 33 power. Luckily, it is just Tayward and didn't actually see them.
I encountered them in BG3 the other day though. In Baldur's Gate 3? Oh boy. Wait! That means when I have actually, since I actually have X, <laughs> since we're doing the family sharing thing, I don't have to get my own copy of Baldur's Gate. I can just put in uh, my new hard drive and then boom, I can download it. Oh, let's go. Okay, she's down to 25. Let's go. Stamina is at 7, reason is 14. Okay. Bitch. So this woman raises her scissors. I need a brace. Where's my brace? Here we go. I lose Just two gonna stamina. steal all of my games, I see. <laughs> Alright, brace for impact. Oh, that was good. You can steal roads too. Exactly. If there's any games of mine that you've wanted to, that you've wanted to do. You can do mine. I have plenty. I hope none of this affects my cloud saves or my playtime hours. It does not. Because it... Your save files are set to your username. It won't. My save files Close are set to my username. Okay. Good. Down to 20. Oh, that did nothing. AHH Kitty is attacking my necklace. Oh, no. Okay, do a strong attack there. Let's go. I'm going to brace. Okay. So I need to use a weapon on her. Ironically, it's the one with him on it, XD. I just need to keep doing a light attack and then brace. Well, I'm not going to be able to... Uh. enough stamina. Fuck. Yep. Frozen in fear, you watch as she gets closer. Her sharp scissors is slowly cutting through your cheeks as she asks you. Am I beautiful? Cause of death, killed by the scissor woman, level one. Difficulty level cultist. All right, summon the old god and coming doom, 5%. Your playthrough lasted 24 minutes. Saw four new events, encountered two new enemies. You didn't unlock any achievements. Okay. You will die at the beginning of your next encounter. Oh, great. All right, let's try that again. Oh, I, no, I'm gonna keep this color. We'll bring it down to initiate. Why did the, I had it at initiate. All 
All right, precious. Precious. Okay. Found a new item, Tayaki. Perfect. I'll want a refresher on the combat. Okay. In Friends Diary. Open it up. Okay. Go back. Explore to school. Tall woman. Help her considering I succeeded before. Yep, there we go. Resolve the event. Seem okay. It's on the roof. Don't want to peek outside, just want to go. On the roof, you find a girl your friend was talking about. In one hand, she holds a bag, and in the other, a pair of bloody scissors. Oh no! Oh boy. Oh, her HP is low. Okay, I need to look for an improvised weapon. Cool, broken bottle. Hell yeah! Ah. That's just enough that I need. Found the blessed chalk. That's not the right. Redraw the sigil. Friend's diary. Hold on. Okay, so it's a triangle facing down. Okay. Is that it? Yes! Haha! <laughs> okay. Gotta be mindful of that. Alright, it should be enough. Hopefully it'll be enough. Now I just need the, the candles. Oh great. Okay, losing some reason. Must hurry. Tayaki gives me reason, yeah? Okay. I'll save that. Explore to school. Oh! Perform the ritual. Here we go. Oh, but that's the right thing! What, does the symbol not matter? Okay, her health is down now. She's getting me good.
Okay. That's not going to help. Oh. Okay, I'm not going to survive this. I can't run. A part of a ritual must combat must combat rituals. Of oh, most combat rituals are a combination of five bows and claps. Even if you don't get a right, you'll be provided with a hint. Can't access the same. Even if you don't get it right, you'll be provided a hint. You know what? We'll do that. Ritual was too long to have an effect. Okay. Third time's the charm. New story. Continue. Alright, come on. Story so far. Turn off the combat tutorial. Okay, investigate. Okay. A strain. Okay, this sigil can weaken them for a while. Okay, careful with the lines. Ads. Oh no! Ads, I'm sorry. Hidden the candles in one of the classrooms tomorrow. Hello, I'm late to stream. All good. Hope you're doing well. Okay, and I'm pretty sure the combination for the ritual is randomized. AM existing. Well, I hope you've been doing well. Even with just existing. Peek outside, let's see. <laughs> oh, great, okay. Well, do I have an improvised weapon currently? Let me get a light attack in as well. Okay, broken bottle. Fuck yeah. Okay. 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 Stabs you with her scissors. Okay. Just one more. There we go. Okay. No, the second set. Okay, I got it. 
Okay. You found the ch Can I inspect the diary more? A strange tall woman has been following me all day. Why is that crossed out? Other pages seem relevant. I hope they're okay. Okay. One out of four, three out of four. Let's, get, let's eat the Taiyaki now. I still need the candles. Let's see, we've. Damn! Okay. Not this fucking again! Okay. Alright. Okay. Now it's your chance to fight and defeat this horror. It's also your only chance. Okay. I'm trying to think. Let's see. What would be the ritual? Like the action combo? I don't have a whole lot of stamina or reason to take many chances. No spells. Okay. Ah. Uh. Let's see. Oh, let's see. Well, wait, hold on. So, is this her? This is the farm that I keep getting. Hold on. Okay. So I just need to get good. Well, damn. Okay, that helped, but I can't do that too often, cause we just got Bendy and the Ink Machine Road XD. Yeah. All right, seven and seven. Oh wow, that was lucky. No, I mean I literally just bought it. Oh. 
I thought you would also talk to, uh... Oh, damn it, I was so close. I thought you also talked to Bluey. Okay. I am so tempted to bring it down to... Yeah, I did, but I went to grab the bundle myself, XD. Oh, <laughs> I'll just bring it down to its lowest difficulty because I'm... Okay, access your storage, friend's diary, boom. Let's... Okay. Yay! Okay. So if you want to download Bendy and play it, you can now XD. Potentially. We'll see what happens. <laughs> it was up there. Okay. Let's find an improvised weapon real quick. Branch. Really? Fine. Should be it. Yeah, cause okay. Yeah, that's the best. Should be correct. Btw, what deity did you end up with this playthrough? Um, it hasn't shown any deities. So, okay, resolve the event. Must hurry. Resolve the event. All right. Okay. She's not all. Okay. I thought it told you what god you get each playthrough. Let's see, you take a step back as a writhing amorphous mass slowly takes shape. Soon it becomes a tall, woman-like creature with three faces, all connected by a wide smile. Okay. Okay, so she does two damage on me. So doing this, it lets me guaranteed to do five damage each turn. I'm just gonna keep doing that. Let's go! The ancient horror lies dead on the classroom floor, slowly dissolving into nothingness. Your friend, you find your friend, gravely wounded but alive. You help her up, and both of you limp away from the school as the police sirens get louder. Face is scuffed, but okay. Incoming doom, only 4%! Yay! 
That's not the only mystery plaguing this town. You must continue your investigation. Okay, I guess we're doing new story. Okay, this option will prepare the the standards. This option will prepare the the standard skeptic playthrough for you, allowing you to start the game without worrying about in-depth stuff for now. Cool. Let's go here. Alrighty. The thing forsaken by God. Banished to another to the other dimension a long time ago. Goizo has found a way or Goizo has found a way to use mirrors to ensnare and teleport its prey straight through reflective glass. The glimpses behind your reflections are just the beginning of a real nightmare. The only God's rule, resting at home, drains doom. The backstory, world of horror, a character exclusive, character exclusive per cards only. First time playing, select this. Welcome and thank you for trying World of Horror. Inspired by adventure games from the 1980s, the visual overload may initially be a little disorienting. In this short tutorial, I'll do my best to explain various elements and prepare you to fight the, the horrible old gods. Powell, creator of the game. This is the main game screen. Here you will interact with your surroundings, solve mysteries, and fight enemies. All performed actions will be added to the log here. That's the user interface part of the screen. Here you will manage your inventory, cast spells, and access the game options. That's you on the right. World of Horror has RPG elements and your and your and your attributes are decided by six basic stats. Move the cursor over them to learn more. Perception stats, dexterity, strength, fun, charisma, and knowledge. Why am I yawning? It's your reason. It represents your stability and will to confront your confront the horrors. Once it reaches zero, your character collapses and the game ends. It's your stamina. It represents your physical health. Once it reaches zero, your character dies. Okay, it's your inventory. go home first, I guess. Check your mailbox. Oh. Can I not open that? Why is number 25 boarded? Back in your home, you think of your next move. You're not currently investigating any weird mystery. Recent newspaper clippings and notes collected in the next room should point you in the right direction. Inexplicable and morbid events have been plaguing your town for some time now. You've marked down five of them, hoping that there is something connecting them. You can tackle these five mysteries in any order you want. Beware, your decisions will haunt you and influence yet unsolved mysteries. Eerie episode of evolving eels, curious case of a contagious coma, chilling chronicle of a crimson cape, alarming account of abnormal arms, I wonder did a contagious coma. Curious case of a contagious coma. More and more people fall unconscious and cannot be awakened. People who try to wake the patients up only end up falling into a coma themselves. 
A whole wing of the town's hospital has been dedicated to warding the comatose. Is there anything connecting these people, and how did the strange illness start? To advance this mystery, investigate the circled location. As you progress, the location and rules may change. Let's check the Neo's reports about this weird disease and try to find the cause before more people fall asleep. Travel to the school. You enter the school bathroom to wash your face with cold water. A sudden noise behind you stops you in your tracks. One of the stall doors is opened on its own. Let's see. We have sanity. We have stamina and reason to spare. You walk. Oh no. You walk to the door and try to close it, but something is blocking it. When you look up, you see a ghostly pale hand holding the door. You back off of the toilet as the door slowly Fun opens. Fact, there was an illness that basically caused exactly this. I can't remember if it was something contagious, but people ended up going into comas over it and ended up like that the rest of their lives because it was incurable. Oh, holy fuck. You back off from the toilet as the door slowly opens. A girl in tattered uniform is standing there. Okay, it took me nearly 10 M to do a game of solitaire. Clear indicator that I need to sleep. Alec, if you need sleep, go sleep. Her head twists unnaturally as she makes a roaring, rattling noise. A door behind you slams shut. Oh boy! And she has 16 health? Broken bottle. Fuck yeah! Oh, it's an incorporeal. Huh? Okay, ritual was too short to have an effect. Okay. Nothing happens. You think got two of the ritual moves right. was too long so it's exactly five oh come on okay I think you got two one two three four five oh come on I'm just leaving. Nope, that didn't appease it. Fuck! Can I flee? Run away. That ate up my reason. Hard fucking core. The roads seem to twist and turn when you're not looking, tripping you in the neighborhood. Plus 2% doom. That could be a lot worse. Alright, need to investigate the hospital. You find yourself in an old, unused part of the hospital. 
You take a deep breath. The disgusting smell of thawed remains still lingers in the room. It used to be the hospital's mortuary, where doctors determined the causes of death. Check the cabinet. Damn it! Something flashes in the corner of a dusty drawer. Too late, you realize it's a rusty scalpel blade and you cut yourself badly. Ow! When the patient came home one morning, covered in scars and babbling about aliens, the police had them committed. They are mumbling something quietly as you pass by. Charisma failure. Fucking you. hell! Miss you too, Magnus. You try reasoning with them to tell you what happened, but it doesn't work. It takes two nurses to calm them down after they've roughed you up. Oof. Oh goodness, why do I keep yawning? Experts are baffled by the sudden appearance of 20 stone statues lined up in a row in the middle of the park. You can cast one GBH, spell- I don't think we need to password counter anymore, sadly. Yeah, I mean, Star gives us passwords occasionally. The investigation is starting to take a toll on your health. You feel like you're about to fall asleep standing up. Buy a coffee. As a part of the therapy, some patients took part in art classes. Some of their work fills you with dread. Man! There it is. Let's hope you find an answer here. Patient Zero. Oh, the quarantine wing. You've managed to sneak through the floor while avoiding the police and finally reach the quarantine wing, where all the coma patients were brought in. Their pulses are slowly weakening and their blood pressure is dropping. You must hurry. The complete silence of this place hits you when you reach one of the beds. All of the patients are dead. Shaken, you sneak out of the hospital. One thing is certain, though, with no sick people left alive, it's the end of this weird illness. Oh, I got the, the B ending. <laughs> I'm just mortified. Knowledge is key, plus 30 experience. There's still hope, minus 5 doom. Tireless, plus 1 reason. See, time passes one day. The old god stirs. Winds of plague. A weird epidemic keeps staff at the hospital busy. Skipping the line will cost you more. A feeling of paranoia and discomfort is almost palpable in the air. Take the key. Back in your home, you think of your next move. You're not currently investigating any weird mystery. Guess we'll go for the evolving eels! While returning to your home, someone suddenly bumps into you. Did you know? You turn around. It's your friend living in the same apartment complex, Kana. That weird dude is back, you know. The one who studies fish? You shrug, opening the door. Kana follows and immediately enters the kitchen. A while later, she returns with two cans of soda. Aren't you curious? What weird fish did he bring this time? She grins. I saw the creepy neighbor carrying some jars inside his apartment. I wonder, what weird fish did he find this time? Will you check it out? He'll surely recognize me if I try to do it myself. I'm hungry and want to go get soda but don't want to make lucky move as he's finally stopped ignoring me TWT. <laughs> Investigate the apartments. Oh, we need to boost our reason somehow.
Dude, it's working at school, right? We could break into his office. <laughs> Aw, oh, damn. The neighbor's office at school is empty. You do find a few jars, all filled with weird eel-like fish. Despite your protests, Kana decides to take one jar home. Have you even seen an eel like this? It's so freaky. Don't you have a feeling it's watching us? Mr. Blank. Your neighbor is a horror manga artist. He's struggling to come up with a satisfying ending for his Neo story. I want my dual monitors so I can still watch but also play my games TWT. <laughs> oh, he gave us funds for that. Let's go. I've seen him burning some notes behind our apartment building. Let's go check it out. A woman jumps out of her apartment, covered in gore. Between sobs, she tries to explain what happened. She was taking a shower when suddenly the shower head started spraying blood. A trail of blood leads in the dark apartment. Can I calm her down first? Oh, that just gave us reason. Let's go. Oh, wait. Yeah, because we have decent charisma. The woman sniffs and smiles weakly. You feel like you've prevented something awful. Let's go! Kana was right. Something tried to burn some papers. Or someone tried to burn some papers. They must have been in a hurry because some of the papers look salvageable. You both return to your apartment and try to decipher the notes. Oh no, there's ads. Fuck! <laughs> That's so weird. Your neighbor really was into eels, it seems. You begin to wonder if spying on their neighbor was a good idea to begin with. Burnt notes. Blank. Let's see. Legend of the Blank Prefecture. Legend of the Blank Prefecture eels tell of a small village of robbers who would kill all visitors and dump their corpses into a lake full of eels. Blank eels of the Blank Prefecture would lay their eggs inside of human remains. I'm assuming it's going to say like human corpses or human remains. Ugh. <sighs> Why have I been yawning? I have not been up that long. All right, investigate the apartments again. Ow. Not wanting to wait for an elevator, you decide to take the rarely used stairs. You suddenly trip, but grab the railing at the last second. When you get up to inspect what caused you to trip, you freeze in terror. It's slowly standing up. Hope everyone's doing well. Welcome back from the ad. Sorry I went a little farther ahead. <coughs> How do you know it wasn't going to say something like inside human titties or inside human genitals slash J? Oh my word. Minus one reason, so I need to be careful. And he's he's incorporeal. So I Monster Preg XD. And just going to get the hell out of Dodge. They mu there must be something more we can learn. I'll try to break into his apartment tomorrow morning. I wonder what he's hiding in there. He shrugged non-committedly. Non yeah, non-committedly. Just wish you could throw this damn jar in the trash. Crabs are feasting on, bloated on a bloated corpse, carried to the beach by the waves. Search the body and see if there's eels. Inside the man's pocket, you find documents that are strangely dry. Just gonna ignore me because I'm being a deacon now. 
XD the... slash LH slash J. I mean, you be a DJ all you want, hun. Did the man really drown or was he brought here? Thinking about how stupid it was of Connor to try and break into your neighbor's apartment, you go to sleep. You spend time you spend that entire day waiting for Connor. Where the hell is she? Oh boy. Our friend is missing. You enter the kitchen, even though it's abandoned and the lights are off, something is cooking in the large pot. We need a weapon. Yay! Ooh, steak knife! Ha <laughs> ha! Let's go. Investigate your neighbor's apartment. Kana's... I feel like Lucky is still NG with me. Oh. Kana's been missing T -W -T. since. You... I'm sure you can make it up to Lucky. Kana's been missing since yesterday. You decide to check out the the neighbor's apartment yourself. Oh, and they're wriggling. You cautiously enter your neighbor's kitchen. You're shocked to see countless chars filled with eels flailing around restlessly. Where the hell is Kana? The swollen body of your neighbor is rotting away inside putrid murky water. Both his eyes are missing with countless tiny blood and tr tiny blood trails leading from leading from them in all directions. Is there a suicide note? Uh, I found the neighbor, but when his eyes burst and I slipped on the blood and lost consciousness, I'm afraid there's something in my own eye now, too. I've watched things that I shouldn't have cause my brain went to places it absolutely shouldn't have upon seeing wriggling eels. Oh my... <laughs> you rush to the hospital with Kana, getting a lot of attention from horrified people. Your friend is taken immediately to the operating theater, and you collapse on a chair in the waiting area. When you wake up, it's already night. Trying to ask about your friend, you're met with weird re reactions, as if she never existed. You rush the, to the operating theater yourself, but are stopped by armed policemen. Whatever happened, the doctors must have been too late to help. You're still processing the events of the previous night. Corpse-eating eels that lay their eggs and eyes? Sitting before your apartment building, you watch the police officers emptying out your neighbor's place. You wonder if you'll ever heal from your friend. If you'll ever hear from your friend again. Plus thirty experience, minus five doom. Let's go. Plus one reason and stamina. Okay. The old god stirs. Contaminated water. There's something wrong with the tap water. It's black and oily and glistening. Smelling like death. You hope it's just a temporary issue. You're not. You're not gonna. Okay. Someone is standing in the shadow, watching your door. Oh, great! I want to save my progress. Alright, yeah, Goizo currently. Okay, we have about like 15 minutes left. Oh! Let's continue. Let's switch to that. 
Oh, I lost my weapon! No rituals active. The TV host is gutting a big octopus. At least that's what she claims, but there's way too many tentacles. Look. Alright, let's just start a new mystery. Crimson Cape. A new game is spreading among your friends. A dare to stay in the unused school restroom after classes. A dare to meet Akamanto. What was originally har harmless fun has turned deadly. The body of a boy was found last week. The school principal has banned the game. But that's only made it more popular. Aka Akamanto must be stopped before another kid is killed. One of your friends says that he doesn't believe in curses, and he intends to complete the dangerous dare. A woman bumps into you as she runs from a beauty parlor. Before you can say anything, you notice her face. She's carved out her own eyes. If I can't see it, she cries. You can't see me, right? You shudder, seeing a faint vision of Goizo reflected in the, in the beauty parlor's mirrors. You've reported it to your principal, who promises... With your friends safe for now, you should look into the legend. Maybe records in the city's library mention of Akamanto. Oh, but you've reported it to your principal who promises he'll take care of it. Let's go downtown. Your reflection twists and shimmers when you're not looking at it directly. Goizo is getting closer. Plus a curse. Oh boy. What curse do we have? Brain damage? Minus two on our knowledge. Plus 10 to our maximum reason. Oh no. Oh no. You read a story about a vengeful samurai. Men known for wearing a crimson red cape. Impossible angles and seemingly moving lines make your head spin. Meet Ikumi. We meet Ikumi. How's this? Alright, one of the articles mentions a young doctor who performed life saving surgery on a victim of a brutal assault. The assault happened in a toilet stall. You enter the hospital looking for information about a certain patient. The main corridor is dark and strangely empty. You spot a nurse at the registration booth. She's asleep from exhaustion. Set the trash can on fire! <laughs> Let her sleep. You abandon the idea of stealing the patient's document. It'll hamper your investigation for sure, but a well-rested nurse means a safer hospital. You learn the doctor suddenly left the hospital after the latest murder, taking all the records with him. Fuck! Why would he do that? That's not the only bad news. Your friend didn't come to school today, and another body has supposedly been found. I was trying to be nice! A weird bubbling sound lures you to the dark shower room. On the floor, you find a swimsuit torn over a grotesque leathery coil. Wait, that's not a coil. Okay. 
Okay, we'll decrease our stamina. She's only a drain swimmer. Let's do an attack. Uh, look for an improvised weapon. All right. Yeah, it's only one stamina that she takes, so that's helpful. Get some experience. There we go. To gain a new level, press the flashing button. Oh, fuck. Available perks. Running shoes. Smaller doom penalty from running from combat. Faster offensive actions. Here we go. Oh. I want to boost my knowledge. And we'll boost my reason. Oh. I can only do one. Fuck. So I'll boost my knowledge for now, just because I need that up. Resolve combat. Principals ordered the school to be closed down for investigation. Oh boy. Okay. I hope everyone has been doing well, by the way. Hearing an eerie sound coming from behind the door, you decide to check it out. At first glance, the abandoned classroom seems empty. Once your eyes get used to the darkness, you discover an unusual sigil drawn on the floor. Judging by, this, by the smoke, someone put out the candles the moment you entered. Let's pick up the book. A dusty grimoire. Oh no, and use his reason! No! There's no turning back now. You step into the last stall and close the door behind you. You wait in the stall, trying to be quiet as possible suddenly. You hear the sound of rubber boots as an unknown liquid drips on the tiles. You can see the top of his head. He's taller than any man you've ever seen. The door slowly opens. A masked man dressed in a red coat, clearly too tall for the ceiling, emerges from outside. Tell me. His voice sounds like a faulty radio. Oh! Is he like red paper or blue paper? Fuck! Blue means that we're that we get choked out. Red means that we just get slashed. Ah. Uh, you hear a click coming from the door's direction. You're locked in here with this crazy man. I just realized Fuck! I am both simultaneously tired and not, but I know I need sleep and I work tomorrow, unfortunately. I need to run. I want to run. So, with that, I wish you a good rest of your stream slash night road. You have a good one. Oh, I'm dead. I am fucking dead. Oh. Dusty Grimoire. This is a brain of effect, but it costs two reason. Huff. Blue would have meant he was weaponless dummy. I didn't know that! PFFFFXD, that's just logic.
to slashy slash needs blade, to choke just needs hands. Okay, this is my strategy. <laughs> I don't have a lot of stamina or reason. And I've been doing good with dodges. It's just a very slow burn with getting them down. I level up. Alright, just wallop. Okay. Blood flowing from wounds in the tall man's red coat. That makes it look like the man is slowly melting. You hear cackling coming from behind the mask and faint. And when you wake up, he's gone. Somehow, you know he'll be back in another stall. Another school, another city, continuing the horror. Chilling Chronicle of Crimson Cape, the Cape ending B. He left something behind, plus 30 experience, minus 5 doom, plus 1 reason and insanity. Let's fucking go. With more and more students going missing, the police have restricted access to the school building. Why do they keep getting so many keys? All right. It is just about midnight, which means it is just about time for us to end it for tonight, which I want to give a massive thank you to everyone that has hopped over for today. Again, hope you're having an amazing Halloween or Samhain or coming up Dia de los Muertos, if that's your thing. A massive, massive thank you to everyone that has hopped over. If anyone has anyone that you want us to read out to, feel Just free. It's literally a minute till. Feel free to redeem the guide, the raid, uh, point redeem. While that's going, I will actually be looking up uh, who is streaming right now. Ooh, actually, I see someone that we could raid out to. <laughs> so let me actually migrate over here and ending for the night satch <laughs> look i only plan to be going until like midnight because i started at eight but a massive massive thank you to everyone that has hopped over for today we are going to be raiding over to the silver lilies Colador void as uh kala is playing well actually let me double check to see who's running for them right now uh but they are playing terraria uh, oh, it looks to be Kala with Monkey Mallow. I nice. was gonna do guide for Kala. Yeah. <laughs> well, we will be ready to read out momentarily. With that, let's actually do a our... stream. Not a problem. Feel free to stick around for the raid. But while we do that, let's also talk about Magnus some of our twelve steps ahead of road <laughs> of our just ending bits. If you want to become part of the community, feel free to become part of the Discord. Do know that like our streams, the community is 18+. Plus. We are LGBTQA2 Spirit Plus, Neurodivergent Disability Mental Health Forward, and we do our best to uplift and advocate for BIPOC uh, folks in their own experiences and their own autonomy. Our biggest thing is just about self-advocacy, autonomy, and individuality. If you want to support me financially in any way, there's plenty of ways to do that. You can either send me a tip over via stream elements. You can uh, check on my throne for any items that you think that you're able to send my way. You can also uh, check out my Kofi, where you can check out commissions or you can just send a simple donation. 
With that said, if you want to check out any VODs when they come out in the future and where they are archived, feel free to check out my card, which includes the, the link to the official VOD channel where most, not all, but most VODs have been archived. And yeah. So, let's get the raid message out. Here's the version for passersby. Ah. Fuck. Here is the version for followers. And here is the version for raiders. So let's send some love and support. Click, click, click. <laughs> so let's check that. Let's check uh, Kala and give him some love and support. Ah, there we go. Do you know the wall? This is the end of stream. This is not the end of our time together. As the road to dusk will always be open for another adventure. Thank you all so, so much for sticking around. Please have a wonderful rest of your morning, afternoon, evening, whatever Just time it is. Just a little pause on my blanket and it was ash. Whatever time it is in your time zone, as we say. Happy Halloween. Hello. Road is the best country road. Ichia haona honoriv. And goodbye.